Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Fairy of Love. How are you? Welcome to your weekly horoscope. Are you feeling the energies of the eclipses? Woo! It's life transforming. This week the sun is in the sign of Leo, Royal Leo. Happy birthday to you, Leos. We love you. We love your glory. You are the kings and the queens of the zodiac. We bow. The moon will travel in the sign of Aries, Taurus, Gemini, and Cancer. And remember, we are in eclipse season. Therefore, cautiousness, prudence, patience, integrity is a must. And the good news this week is Saturday for lovers, artists, and spiritual seekers will be very, very happy and blessed. Why? Because Venus, planet of love, will make a beautiful blessing trine to Neptune, planet of dreams and spirituality, bringing romantic feelings, strong imagination, heightened creativity, and spiritual inspiration. And also a big news this week, later on Monday, Mercury, planet of communication, will go retrograde for the third time this year, an ideal time for personal recycling, reviewing, reinventing, redoing, re-everything. It's a re-re-re, retrograde for three weeks. And Sunday, the hot sun will also make a beautiful, nice trine to white Saturn, for the second time and the last time this year, being both in fire sign, it will actually make a Sunday filled with joy, laughter and fun, even if we have to work. Tuesday, big news also, Venus planet of love will come under fire, making some kind of tough square to lucky Jupiter and transformative Pluto also affecting the financial sector. So if you are doing some investment or banking or any kind of playing with currencies, it's a day that you should have some surprises. So do something before that day. Pull back, go into cash or do something. But this is a day that could bring some unexpected surprises. Also relationships will go through some deep transformation and it need anything to do with music, art also, there's going to be some re-evaluation, redoing, rethinking, rearranging in these matters as well. It's for a little short while, but it will sort of be strong. So be aware when we are warned ahead of time, when we are be, uh, warned, we, we could take, you know, some step to sort of uh, control and manage the energy better. Also, it's a very, very, very important time right now for deep transformation for all of us for total rebirth for most of us. And it's like the spiritual self, the higher self, our connection back to the source is very much heightened and we are pushed, the higher self is pushing us out of the human car to get into the, into the human car in order to drive it. So this is the Aquarian age coming our way and it's all happening. And the eclipses and Mercury going backwards, well, it's doing all that magic and it's all beautiful and positive. We just have to put the brakes down and go more mind and spirit and, uh, and heart and just to be less concerned about the material things, but still take care of them in a nice integrated way. So slowly but surely, lovingly, spiritually is the way to go. So let me start with you, Leos. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Mercury retrograde in your financial sector brings new knowledge and new ways to handle things in financial matters and solutions also with your budget and maybe some breakthroughs that you didn't expect. What was not available last couple of months is available for you now. It's all about your generosity of heart and doing things that is good for you, but also for other people. You have the ability to really solve problems this week like, like a genius. In career, teamwork is best and also a good time to make others happy, but then again, do it your way. Family, dear friends are definitely uh, on your side. Ask and you shall receive. That's your sentence this week. On the weekend, relax, recharge your batteries. Your magical color, yellow, lucky number, 6 and 33. Virgos, Mercury retrograde in your sign makes you very confident, but sensitive at the same time. You also get answers to your questions. 
and you also receive confidential information from other people that help you make those decisions. In your personal life, you see things clearly and you are definitely moving in the right direction. The key to your success is patience, flexibility, and kindness. Don't make any important decisions without thinking through first, really deep. And the weekend, something special for you awaits from you or somebody else. The magical color for you is blue, lucky numbers 7 and 34. Libra, Mercury retrograde in your spiritual sector makes you quite intuitive, aware and sensitive and also very caring. A good time to spend more time with yourself. You have worked very hard lately, I mean for the many months behind, so why don't you try to take some breaks in the next couple of weeks, you know, with all the things happening, spend more time with your friends, your family, and people you love. On the weekend, home sweet home is where you will want to be all the way. Your magical color blue lucky numbers, 835. Scorpio's Mercury retrograde in your social sector bring you wisdom, strong intuition, and also kindness. In personal life, you really can catch your breath. Ah, <sighs> you can have a break. You could really, um, you could see, you could move more slowly and more confidently. You have helped many people lately, and now you are sort of helping yourself for a change. And people are giving you back in some magical way. At work, pay attention to all the details. And in the weekend, friends and loved ones will prove to you how much they care. If you're traveling, you'll have a good, good time. Your magical color red, lucky numbers nine and forty-five. Sagittarius, Mercury retrograde in your career sector, brings wisdom, generosity, it slows you down. You also have more patience. The focus is on knowing who you are, what you want to accomplish in the next year, in the near future. And just listen to you, the soul message. Listen to your inner self. Family, friends are definitely supportive. It's also a great time to let go of grouches, bitterness, hate, all that yuck, yuck, yuck. It's time to forgive, forget, and really support the people you love, okay? On the weekend, explore your inner self, your higher self. Everything to do with yoga, meditation, spiritual seminars, going to church, to the temple, very good for you. Your magical color, fuchsia, lucky numbers 1 and 23. Capricorn, Mercury, retrograde in your karmic sector, bring you high intuition, lots of sensitivity. You may feel like a little baby and you want to be hugged, but also a lot of generosity of heart. At work, cooperation and teamwork are the magical words. The times of the communications right now are sort of up and down, but somehow you'll be able to use your leadership quality to make everything more in flow. And people will say, thank you. Soul searching brings also a lot of answers in your personal life. It's all, all going to make sense. You will be a little fragile for a couple of weeks, but at the end of the day, you'll become a giant. On the weekend, your family warms your heart. That's exactly what you need. Your magical color is lilac, lucky numbers 2 and 11. Aquarius, Mercury retrograde in your shared resources sector brings adjustment in your relationships and also a better understanding of your own feelings towards other people and how they feel about you and ask for fairness. You need to follow your gut in love, not your mind, not your money, your, your heart. The key is also humor, laughter, and by, by laughing at it all and having a positive, optimistic approach to everything, you will definitely have the last word. It's also important to take the time to the other people's opinion, especially in career, in finance, and at work. On the weekend, keep feelings by yourself, okay? Listen to other people what they say, but keep your feelings inside for now. In two weeks, you could start sharing. Your magical color, violet, lucky numbers, 3, 21. Pisces, Mercury retrograde in your relationship sector, bring you a strong imagination, a desire to love, to be loved, creativity, and also inspiration. The muses are smiling at you, so it's still better to take it easy and go with the flow this week. You can create also a masterpiece if you're doing something in the art, in the innovation, in science, if you're a musician, you're an artist, 
a creator, a, a, a writer. It will be fabulous. On the weekend, dream in colors. Your magical color, purple, lucky like numbers, 4 and 22. Ta-da! Aries, Mercury, retrograde in your work sector brings you feedback in career and also some memories from the past in love and powerful intuition. You feel things deeply. Get ready for more closeness. If you are a lover, also with friends and family, more closeness awaits. A good time also to invest in peace and forgiveness all week. On the weekend, kindness and gratitude await. Your magical color, orange, lucky numbers 2 and 11. Taurus, Mercury, retrograde in your creative sector, bring you determination and very good judgment, a good sense of business. Whatever you're doing, you are doing it well and it will pay off big time in the long run. And make sure that uh, you are flexible when it comes to some changes of plans or delays. It's all gonna work in your favor. So just take it as it is. In career, your dedication and your patience will be rewarding and definitely time is on your side in everything in your life. And women will play key role this week. On the weekend, loved ones show they care in a very special way. Your magical color is turquoise, lucky numbers 3 and 21. Ta-da! Gemini, Mercury, retrograde in your home sector bring more freedom of action and more time to play and relax. In career, you have new opportunities to make things different and make a fresh start. So think it through for the next few weeks. Your perseverance, your determinations will lead you to success. Your personal life is definitely more stable, making you feel better, more in peace, and on the weekend, relax and do something fun for you. Get a massage or go to a seminar, go to the beach, swim, or connect with people you love or you haven't seen for a long time. Leo, Libra, and Cancer definitely are allies, and your magical color is turquoise, lucky numbers, 4 and 31. Cancers, Mercury retrograde in your communication sector bring you high sensitivities. It's also, you're very intuition, you're very psychic. It also brings healing and protection from other people. So get ready to receive some miracle somewhere from the universe, from people you love or some friends. Your loved ones also really appreciate your generosity of heart. You have a lot of admirers and it's a week that you should ask and you shall receive. There's some little financial surprise happening to you, also probably at the end of the week. And the week will start slow, but at the end of the week, Friday, you will say, wow, I've done a lot. Family, health, peace of mind are definitely the most important now. On the weekend, loved ones will comfort you. Hope is truly in the air. So enjoy, you're doing good. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers, 532. And now here's your wizard affirmation of this very interesting Mercury retrograde and eclipse season kind of week. Laughter, laughter, ha ha ha, gives hope its wings. You want to have hope in your life? Keep laughing. And I'm telling you, that laughter will give wings to your hope and make things happen. I love you. Be good now. Take it easy and follow your heart, not your mind in these eclipse times. Love you, bye, be good.